Yeah, I'm here um, enjoying the day, you know, doing a bike ride, you know, and getting to know the city, right? And uh, uh, damn, I just bought these beautiful Nautica, you know, sneakers. Nice. But I, 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 I don't like to wear white sneakers because they get dirty. And then people be looking at you all funny and shit. Like, why don't you clean your shoes? Why don't you clean your shoes? That ain't cool. That ain't cool. No. Clean your shoes. Nigga, that's what you find important. That's what you find important. That's what your priority is like. Well, you know, I got up uh, three in the morning. Uh, it's always at three in the morning. Always at three in the morning. And oh my God, I had this vision. You know, I was having a fight with somebody. And you know, it was me and a, f- and a few other guys, and I'm in a fight. And you know, you could tell he was rich, I was rich, you know, the other guy was rich, you know, we were, it, was, it was like we were having a, it was like we were rivals, you know. I dominated Houston, he dominated Dallas, and the other guy dominated Austin, Texas. And we were fighting over territory. Like, it looked, it seemed like we had businesses and we were expanding and I wanted to expand into Dallas and into Austin, you know, bring my empire to the other cities. They had the same agenda too, with their empires. And we're fighting and fighting and screaming and pulling and fighting. And it was so real that all of a sudden, one of my archives, tells me, Fernando, look, 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 telling me to look up, so I look up, and I see a flying saucer of the shape and the lights that I've never seen before. It looked like a bus. Like a metro transit bus. And it had many windows. But it, it, it that, that was the inside. You could see through it. You could see through it. Like a jellyfish. In fact, the bus was encapsulated inside of a jellyfish. Or it looked like a jellyfish. And it was moving in the sky like a jellyfish and we got and when it would do this it would throw like bubbles of fire and it was like dark blue it was beautiful very luminescent at night at night and everybody watching oh my god oh 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 look at it and you can tell that it was disrupting our weather. And you know, and it kept coming down towards us, but it, it was going down towards us in a very systemic way. It wasn't going like, yeah, here it is. It was, it was moving like in a matrix or labyrinth that you couldn't see. And it was going like this in a back square motion until it reached us. But before we get to that, we were, we were seeing like two or three of them. And I'm telling you, they move like jellyfish. And they were throwing these bubbles of fire. Do you know the movie Star, 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 
Starship Troopers came out a long time ago with Denise Richards. You know Denise Richards. She was the wife of Martin Sheen. Right? Uh, you know, the wife of Two and a Half Men. Uh, she was a model, you know. Because, uh, you know, it was, it, it, that, she was the only real notable star that I remember. Oh, no. The guy from Dookie Hauser. From Dookie Hauser, MD. Remember Dookie Hauser? He was in, the, in that movie, too. He was the general. And the girl, uh, played by Denise Richards, she was a navigator of them ships. And then you had the, uh, a white dude, unknown, from Argentina, you know, right? Um, it was a good movie. It was about these roaches, cockroaches. But they were like monsters from space. And they were throwing shit to Earth, you know? It was, it was kind of an eerie movie. Where they go to this planet and infested by roaches. That's real, by the way. I'm going to talk about that at another time. Well, it was like that. You know, it was moving like that. It was throwing this thing. And when every time it propelled, it threw these bubbles of fire. That was at night. That was at night. In the daytime, they were blue, but not blue, dark, luminescent blue like at night. It was blue like our blue sky in the day. And you could barely see them. They were like invisible, but you could see the silhouette. And it was like a fucking bus. Again, inside of a, what they appeared to be like a jellyfish. And they were aggressive in the daytime. They kept moving faster, faster, downwards. And then some of them reached, you know, uh, atmosphere level, us, our level here. And they started attacking some humans. It even took taking some humans like, oh my God. So they were, me and, and my two other guys that were fighting, we joined forces and we started running, running. And by the time they reached our level, they were coming food. They were like, yeah. And you see people go, ah, ah, ah. And they were like, they were being engulfed, sucked in, boom, boom. And I'm like, fuck this bitch. I ain't gonna get caught up in this. And I'm running. Right, and it felt like I was running in slow motion. And the harder I tried to run, the harder it was for me to run. And me and the other two guys, we we, we it's like we we merged from somewhere, you know. And we we held each other and trying to run from these things. They, they were like probes. And before you knew it, you could you could see on the sides of the of the of the view, of the peripheral vision, you could see the the tentacles going. Eh, we were ah, and I got out of the dream. Get out of the vision. I'm like, what the fuck is this? Then they told me, I'm like, wow, wow, wow. If you read the Upanishads or the Bhagavad Gita, where you had the, the battles, that they, they talk about it, but they talk about it in their fucking books. That's gonna happen again. The cycle for that is gonna happen again. There are probes coming to this planet, surveying life here. It's like the Empire Strikes Back. Did you remember Star Wars, the Empire Strikes Back? Do you remember, do you remember the beginning of the movie? Where they had probes looking for Luke Skywalker? That they were like in the snow. They were, do, 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 do. They were looking and they were gathering samples. And there were probes. That's happening here. Let me tell you, nothing is new under the sun. They're coming, and there are other types coming too, not just the, the, the ones that I'm familiar with. Others are coming. It's like there's going to be a big galactic event that's going to take place here, and we are the front seat of it. And beings from all other star systems are coming here, taking a, a seat. They're buying tickets to see what the fuck is going to go down here. Hey, big. I'm like, damn. Right? Damn. I mean, damn. What does it mean? What does it mean? Listen, I, I, I can't make heads or tails of these visions. But it was like, 
what the fuck is going on? Are you guys having similar visions? I like to know. I just thought I tell you, guys, please donate. 347-485-6258 under Zelly or PayPal. Uh, the people's asked her to PayPal. If you want a reading or birth chart, it's Saturday. I am done. I caught up with everybody. I caught up with everybody. So it's free rain now. You can talk to me. 281-690-8825. That's my number. You can reach me personally for a birth chart or a reading. And you can donate at 347 347- Four eight five six two five eight. Guys, thank you. But wow, what a fucking download!